Yes, we've been hearing cheers, and we've also been seeing people watching as all this happens. The streets right now are blocked off, but let's get right to what you need to see right now. There's a crane here over by the statue of John Hunt Morgan. That's where crews are working to start to dismantle that statue and relocate that statue. The move tonight was somewhat unexpected. At the council meeting, we mentioned they had talked about moving these statues in November. People here told us they were caught off guard, and now the two Confederate statues outside the old Fayette County Courthouse are being taken away piece by piece. An astonishing scene in downtown Lexington, two Confederate statues at the center of debate being dismantled and sent off to private storage. It was a surprise for DeBron Thomas to say the least. This is not how I thought I was going to be spending my evening tonight, to be completely honest with you, but um, I, my heart is just filled with so much joy. Mayor Jim Gray's office says this comes as Kentucky Attorney General Andy Bashir issued an opinion that the Kentucky Military Heritage Commission does not have jurisdiction over the two statues downtown, as originally thought. In August, WLWT was the only Cincinnati station there as the Lexington Fayette Urban County Council voted unanimously to move them and celebration rang out. Last month, the Lexington Cemetery trustees gave conditional approval to move the statues to the cemetery where both men are buried. The mayor's office says tonight the statues are being moved to protect them and allow restoration work at the old courthouse in Cheapside Park. It's one more step in the right direction for a healing that's needed to happen for a long, long time. The mayor reinforced tonight the move and relocation of the statues is, quote, largely being donated and paid for with private funds. And with each piece moved, a sigh of relief for people like Thomas. Right now, I feel like we're speaking for all of those people who had no voice 130 years ago. Back here live tonight, that work continues here in downtown Lexington, and not everyone is pleased. People have vocalized they aren't happy about the move as they go by. There have also been concerns about a white nationalist rally here in Lexington. City officials tell us they hope moving these statues will hopefully, maybe, stall those plans. We are live in downtown Lexington. Dan Griffin, WLWT, News 5.